used videos sir as a revision tool i used to watch it uh, to i watched the videos like twice on 2x so they were a revision tool sir i bring in all the wishes and greetings on behalf of all the faculty members uh, to dr anshu saini for scoring a topmost rank of aml rank number 3 uh, in a super speciality of mch plastic and reconstructive surgery and any ss session april 2024 congratulations to you, doctor thank you so much sir great now can you tell us a brief history from where you started till date what all you have done so i did my mbbs from gjs faridkot and my ms from gmc patiala and i completed my ms last year in august after that i gave my neat uh, i got a rank of around 600 and uh, i wanted to take up uh, plastic only by then but i didn't get uh, safdajan back then and rml so i wanted to aim for delhi colleges only uh, because of the bond thing and uh, they are the premier institutes so i did not get that and uh, then i started preparing for the ini i started preparing from jan itself this year so then i gave the neat and the you result is there sir yes sir you got it in delhi in yes, delhi sir. aims in delhi that i don't know right now sir <laughs> <laughs> great now yes sir why plastic surgery sir actually i took up ms general surgery in my, uh, after seeing a plastic surgeon in my ug college only so oh. i was really impressed with the kind of work that they do so yes sir that was one of the reasons and i think it's a perfect blend of uh, science and artistry and creativity sir so i'm more into that also okay so yes, once sir. you decided to do uh, plastic surgery then what are the steps you have been taking to move towards it and today to achieve rank number 3 what all you have done so to be honest i did not consider ini in the first place i was just preparing for neat so when i did not get the college of my choice in neat i started uh, preparing from uh, jan jan of this year so i was doing my sr ship uh, completing my bond um, and meanwhile preparing for the ini so january like first first of january itself i started preparing so i uh, read um, basically i uh, concentrated all my time on reading grab and smith sir because uh, being uh, in general surgery background we don't have much knowledge of uh, plastic surgery so i wanted to get a comprehensive uh, outlook of the entire subject i read all the 100 chapters i gave it multiple readings uh, three or four times so minimum and on top of that i also consulted keynotes on plastic surgery so that is a very good book for uh, fast revision and i used videos sir as a revision tool i used to watch it uh, to i watched the videos like twice on 2x so they were a revision tool sir my god <laughs> what are and, and, and to be honest sir before january i had never touched grab and smiths and i never even uh, thought of uh, doing it that way so i after losing my deposit of 2 lakh in neat sir and not taking up any seat i had to do everything in my power to crack this session of ini sir so grab and smith you read and uh, you took notes yeah key notes sir and videos uh, for revision basis sir how you could revise, how you could revise this notes and the video so what i used to do was i used to complete there are like nine uh, units uh, of grab and smith so after completing one unit i used to see all the videos of that unit and they helped uh, me to consolidate all my knowledge how did and match? the grab and smith in the video how they match because this are more of a blend of academic plus the the clinical see every every is about like theory plus also the surgical part they have in the Gra- yeah definitely so grabs me i like after my first reading i just point, uh, highlighted all the important points and i just concentrated on the important points and the videos after, after reading the grabs the videos were like a proper crux of those uh, important points itself so i got like double revision of uh, that things so. so it becomes easy to understand than yes, the general sir, surgery yes, the general surgery background going and watching the video it is entirely different, different preparation sir uh, yes <laughs> that, that is i tried watching videos first but then i couldn't really get um, understand it properly so i decided to go along with the reading grabs and smith sir then the, then it make all sense to see what they're saying and how it is as all happening 
because there is no exposure of plastic surgery in general surgery department yeah, definitely so definitely so okay what about your practice i mean how did you practice did you give the grant test i mean how did you assess yourself I mean, so I majorly up. initial two months I concentrated on reading, like completing my syllabus, and then I had uh, done one MCQ book, I uh, Agarwal's MCQ book, and the question bank, sir. I had taken like screenshot of the important questions that that were to be remembered, and then further revision only. I I didn't give many tests, but I concentrated on the question bank, sir. Okay, right. Yes, sir. Doctor, how many questions did you attend? I attempted seventy-three questions, sir. Very good. Seventy-three, yes, sir. Did you prepare the general surgery or not? Uh, I think, sir, my preparation for NEET helped me. Uh, but already I you concentrated. Prepared. You have prepared yes, already. Sir. <laughs> yes, <laughs> sir. Yes, sir. And aims like particularly they concentrate on the generals, uh, the endocrine, sir, the trauma and the perioperative. These are the main topics that they concentrate in aims. So I just like thoroughly revised those topics again. Doctor, your interview part. I mean, can you share something on that? So this for uh, this time, uh, it was different. They asked us to prepare a PowerPoint slides, so like presentation, five six slides. It was something like a short CV only. So uh, I had total six vivas, and uh, two of the vivas they were reading my CV alongside and asking me questions from that, and then. In other vivas, they were asking about what all have you seen in plastic surgery, and whatever you said, then they asked on that uh, on those surgeries, and some pet questions like uh, Nagpur classification, Balakrishnan contribution. <laughs> these were the basic ones, sir. Okay, great. Yes, sir. Now, what will be advice for future aspirants of MCS plastic surgery? Oh, sir, so if I can do it, I think I just prepared for three months and all. To be honest, sir, if I can do it, you have to give it your all. So, like, if you want to reach here, then you don't have to think about anything else. Just give it your all, and sure, uh, the luck will be on your side, sir. I mean, how the speed was a kind of a reference tool. I mean, how it helped. I mean, what it contributed for you to. In the revision uh, uh, aspect, sir, like ten days before the exam, I watched all the videos in two x, sir. I made sure to sort of revise the all the important points. That was, uh, uh, and the instrument video that helped because uh, being general surgery uh, background, sir, we don't know many uh, much things about the instruments and all. So that helped, sir. Okay, now uh, time to thank and whom all you want to thank. You can use this platform to do so. Who oh, made your career till date? So first of all, my parents, sir, they are my biggest cheerleaders. Uh, God, sir, my UG and PG friends, sir, uh, they help me a lot. And who needs the kind of emotional support that they provide, sir? It is very important. Right, wonderful. We once again we wish you all the very best and all the success for a wonderful and a great career in plastic surgery. And the passion that you have yes, for sir. that is quite amazing. And definitely, you, start, you will be able to do wonders for the patients who are coming to you. Best wishes to you, doctor. Thank you so much, sir. Thank you.